This speaker is going to be um, a Buddhist representative, a Buddhist speaker, the Venerable Tejadharma Bhikkhu. Could I ask you to come to the oh, okay. to right. the speaker's rostrum, please? Okay. Thank you. A Buddhist response uh, to this can be a very short, shorter than five minutes, um, and uh, that's because uh, within the Buddhist tradition um, there uh, there's no uh, creation story as such, um, um, and, uh, and the Buddha's response uh, when he was asked by various people about creation, about whether the universe is finite or infinite, and so on, uh, the Buddhist answer was silence. And when people complained about this, which is inevitable, um, <laughs> because people, people want answers, and they didn't understand that silence was the answer, um, the, the Buddha uh, said that there are certain questions um, the answers to which are inconceivable. Um, and uh, one of those is the origin of the universe. Uh, inconceivable in the sense that it's impossible for the human mind to wrap itself around uh, something like that since it's a product of the thing that it's actually trying to, uh, to deal with. So uh, the two things that struck me in the film, the first one was fishy compassion, which had never occurred to me before. Um, when he mentioned that um, maybe that was the origin of, uh, of compassion um, and uh, they showed a shot of uh, a fish rescuing its baby, baby fish. I'm not sure I'd buy that, but anyway. <laughs> um, I think compassion is a little bit more than that. Um, but the, th the thing I was most struck by, um, strangely, was the very end, the word gratitude, which came up. Um, because it seems to me that uh, the Buddha um, places a great emphasis on, on gratitude in, in Pali, it's Katanyu. And he says that, um, that the person who does not have gratitude is uh, uncivilized and uncultured. And what he means by that is that the person who doesn't have gratitude fails to understand their connection with other human beings and other sentient beings. And because of that, um, and because of uh, greed and uh, in all its forms, because of hatred in all its forms and aversion, and because of the deluded thing, uh, then um, suffering arises. So I was very struck by the fact that the film ended with that word, uh, gratitude, um, because in, in the teaching of the Buddha, at least, that's very important. The Buddha was very much a pragmatist and, uh, and was concerned, he said uh, often, with su suffering and the ending of suffering, overcoming of suffering. So he wasn't interested in, in, as much as we might like him to be interested in contemporary scientific issues, he was not interested. He was interested in human suffering and how do we overcome suffering. So um, although a lot of uh, Western Buddhists like the idea that the Buddha or Buddhism and uh, modern science somehow are paralleling each other, I think the Buddha would have um, um, have a different view. Um, so uh, the two important things, I think, were the gratitude um, and the, the idea of uh, compassion were in the film. So, Thank you very much.